Edify is built in the spirit of collaboration. Teachers can share course content such as resources, lessons, and assessments across Edify. Curriculum administrators have a slightly different role in Edify than teachers, but aspects of this account type help facilitate team collaboration. They have expanded access to content within the system and the ability to publish templates to teachers, as well as the ability to manage master templates, teacher templates, and student courses. Because a curriculum admin has access to all levels of a course, they can modify student courses just like a teacher. Go to Manage, then Courses, search for the course you wish to make changes to, then next to the master template, click Expand. This will show you all of the teacher templates that are available, as well as the student courses that have been published from those teacher templates. You can click the pencil to edit. On this page, you will see the same view a teacher will see when editing their teacher template, except for, as a curriculum administrator, you can make edits to locked units. This includes adding lessons and changing pre and post tests. You can also lock units so that teachers cannot add lessons and cannot make changes to pre and post tests. This will be explained in a secondary resource document. You can also edit all elements of courses and assessments for teachers, including updating assessment questions and traits, editing resources and content, and editing due dates. You do all of this in the exact same manner you would as editing from a teacher account. The primary role of a curriculum administrator is making sure that teachers are getting the correct course templates. This can include using pre-made templates that are available for public use or creating a new master template for use by your school. Curriculum administrators publish from master templates to teachers. When a curriculum admin views a master template, they can click the Publish to Teacher template. Here, they fill in the name of the course that will show up as the teacher template. They choose the description. They choose the subject, the district, and the schools. Selecting the district and school is vital because it narrows down the list of teachers that are published to. Then they select the year, they select the term, and they select the list of teachers that will receive the template. Then they click publish. Once the success notification shows up at the top of the page, the teacher template will now be viewable from that teacher's teacher dashboard. Administrators can then make adjustments as necessary on the master template and sync them to the teacher templates. This works to prevent teachers from all having to do similar work and instead focuses large scale edits into one simple process. Curriculum admins can also access student usage reports. If a teacher has doubts about how much time a student is actually spending in a course, the teacher can request a usage report from the curriculum admin. Simply click reports, then click usage by student. Enter the date, then enter the student's name. This will show for a specific date the amount of time a student has spent in each of their courses. This reporting allows teachers to make judgments on whether a student should be allowed to continue through the course or whether they may need to spend more time working through the content.